Alright, it's gonna be a let's play of Mega Man 2, my favorite Mega Man for the NES. It's actually my favorite Mega Man of all time, actually. And I'm just gonna play it on normal mode. If you guys want, put it in the comments and I'll beat it for you on difficult. Um, always for me, Airman first. Gotta beat Airman first. Alright, here we go. Now, Airman's level, probably one of the most annoying levels, just because these little heads that shoot out are their little heads. But you know, get it done with quick. Probably one of the easiest one to farm free lives on too if you wanted to. Just stand on one of his head and it will continuously spawn those little heads. Alright. Just jump from uh, flying Nimbus to flying Nimbus, you know. Every day in the life of Mega Man. Oh man. Get ready for it. Get ready for it? Okay. And you land it. To the next one. <laughs> Never got why there's like little people inside of the uh, platform you're walking on, just like looking out. But you know, it's kind of cool. Oh yeah, get that health back. Alright, about halfway through the level already. Okay. Oopsies. Get the health back. So I'm surprised getting the health back so quickly when I'm getting hit. Just because, you know, health is normally pretty hard to come by. Oh, I guess I'm used to playing difficult, I guess. I don't know. Just in my past experiences. I don't know if it's difficult or not, like, or because I'm not on difficult. I'm just used to seeing less health. Yeah, that's a lot of health. Anyways. I'm gonna put the health. Killing these mini airmans. You know, they're, they're fatter and bigger. They're not as tough as the real airman. So that gives him the rank of a mini airman. Alright. Dr. Wily's first robot. Airman. Here we go. Easy mode. Easy mode. That's the cool thing about Airman, when he jumps from one side to the other, he doesn't go right against the wall, so you can just pick him off when he jumps to the other side. Alright. And that's the first robot. I'll skip the, the parts where I'm getting the abilities because it takes a while. Alright, back to stage select. Oh, I just got item number two, which is the little like air scooter. And I got the Airman ability for beating Airman. To Crashman I go. Crashman's next because Airman destroys Crashman in like two hits. Alright. This is a pretty wild looking level. And this is another level where it's fairly easy to uh, farm free lives because those guys are on like every screen. And they We'll drop three lives. One of the things I love about Mega Man 2, the music is so supreme in it. Oh, Fred. What a practice. I'm playing Mega Man X. Ah, oh, screw it. Not. 
wasting time for a tick of health. Great music. Oh, I just tried to do the dash from Mega Man X. Yeah, the controls from Mega Man X are definitely a lot smoother. So, I'm gonna be a little bit rusty at the beginning, but I should be able to get used to it. Okay, continuing on our way. I'm about halfway done the level now. Climbing towards the sky. The most annoying part about the levels coming up is where you have to climb the two ladders all the way to the sky. All the way to the top of the level. That's how you handle them. But getting hit. That part's really annoying because if you get hit, most of the time you fall off the edge and you have to climb all the way back up. Then you have to deal with him again. Now you want to go up the left ladder. Because the left ladder is actually the right way to go. Now there's a way to do it. I think you want to be facing towards the right? No. Nope. You want to be facing towards the left. So the birds come from the left. And then on. By the time you get to the next screen, you don't have to deal with it, I don't think. Oh. Well, or maybe I do have to face right. I'm not sure. There we go. Face left on the far left ladder. It just drops it off the edge. So you don't have to kill those little birds. Kill that guy fast. So you don't have to deal with his bullets knocking off the ladder. Get here. Oh wait, it's just an energy tank. You have to go back down. Great thing about Big Airman. You get number two. Just take a little bit of a shortcut. Bam. And for that... You also get a free life. Now, you're safe from them. If you stand up next to the these little walls. Unless they're jumping from to the left of you. Doesn't really matter. You can farm lives and stuff off those guys. But you don't need to. I'm just gonna two shot this guy anyways. Done. So easy. Airman. Alright. After beating Crash Man, I am now going to excuse me. Um go for Metal Man. I almost forgot her to go next. Now as a kid, Metal Man was like the only level I could beat. And then I learned to be Bubble Man's level 2. And Bubble Man is really easy if you have Metal Man. So yeah. I was a pretty new kid. But I eventually got good enough to beat this game on difficult, so... I was proud. I was really proud. But I'd always use like the Game Genie as a kid. And still couldn't even beat the game with the Game Genie. That's how much of a fail I was. Deal with those pieces of crap. And just like, like every single level on Mega Man, pretty much. Mega Man 2. I could farm off these guys. Get some free lives, get some health, get whatever I need. Well, I'm just gonna keep moving. Alright. Let's carry on our way. Let me get the bonus. Oh yeah. He gets all the bonus free lives. I should switch back into the normal X Buster. Not Crash Man, but the X Buster. There we go. Let's just do it.
stupid clowns riding gears? Who comes up with this stuff? I don't know. Whoever does, I love them. Because this game is amazing. Oh yeah. The second energy tank of this level. Being pretty generous this level. Number two, that suck. Oh yeah, all over number two. Now, those enemies, they're pretty troll because the second you jump, they slow down because they're only go fast when you're on the same level as them. So it takes a little bit of getting used to jump over those guys. So you like try to jump, but they slow down the second you jump. So you have to jump pretty close to them. Dead. Man, I remember that was the only boss I could beat. Look at me now. Alright, stage select. Now that I have Metal Man, it's time for Bubble Man to pay. All over this guy. Frick. Speed that up. Oh yeah. This is how you do it. Living in style. Killing little frogs. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. See how quick I jumped off of those things? Some of them didn't even fall. Just because I'm all over this game. Done. Done. Jump into the water. And just like in all other Mega Man games, jump into the water. Got crazy jumping skills. Don't want to get to your head though. There's spikes on the roof. So you can hear me press the buttons. But, you know, at least you know I'm not using turbo. This part's kind of annoying. Just because you might hit the roof. Always afraid that you might. And these things don't make it any easier. Oh yeah. All over those spikes. All over that thing too. Just gonna destroy that sucker. Oh yeah. Dead. Now we get flying crabs everywhere. Don't gift crabs. Don't be like Mega Man 2 and gift crabs to your friends. You won't have any friends left. Alright. And we will see how owned Metal Man is. He's so good. He's he makes this game. He's just freaking the bomb. Gotta love Metal Man. Dead! See how quick that was? There's like three bullets. I've lost one tick of, of my ability. Freaking Metal Man, the bomb. <laughs>